It was only eleven dollars. And forty-seven cents. Well, even if it were a dollar, I'd still be upset. I know. <laughs> oh, Margaret, it's not the money. It's the principle. Oh, no. Not the principle. Not again. <laughs> Do I have to remind you the Thrifty Mart incident? I told you never to bring that up. <laughs> what happened? Not important. Uh, the judge thought it was important. Mark, Mark. Channel 2 Action News thought it was important. The mayor's office thought it was... Thrifty Mart. That was you? Oh, my God. Did you really put a guy in a wheelchair? He was in the wheelchair before I ever touched him. <laughs> Wisdom like that. And they gave Dr. King the holiday. <laughs> Chico, California. Sleepy little town or the front for a billion dollar scam? Reg, do you have any idea what he's talking about? Oh, what's the matter? Are you worried he's not gonna tell us? Good point. I'll tell you exactly what I'm talking about. The phone company's screwing me out of $11.47. That's it? It's not the money, Reg, it's the principal. Oh, Becker, not the principal. Didn't you learn your lesson at the Thrifty Mart? Oh, what? Like, like no one else has ever been banned from a retail chain for life? That was you? You really pushed a guy in a wheelchair off a cliff? It wasn't off a cliff. It was down a hill. For your information, you know, the dumpster broke his fall. I don't know why everyone's making such a big deal about this. Because it was a big deal. The guy was handicapped, John. Huh? Why is it everyone always sticks up for the guy in the wheelchair? <laughs> Next thing you know, th there's a demonstration outside my office. I mean, they're actually carrying picket signs and, 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 and marching back and forth. Well, not marching, you know. All I know is a simple apology would have diffused the whole situation. Quit calling that kid. Pay the money. It's only 11 bucks. It's the principal, Margaret. <gasps> Sir, you... please calm down. I'll get my supervisor. Yeah, you get your supervisor. Mr. Minditch, you're needed out front. You do that. I'll talk to Minditch. Uh, I'll straighten everything out with Minditch. Minditch. How can I help? Oh, my God, it's you, Becker. Minditch. I, I mean, have we met? You're damn right we have. This is the maniac that attacked me at the Thrifty Mart. Oh. We were waiting in line and you went crazy on me. He's insane. I, I, I've never seen you in my entire life. And you cut in line. I did not. You did too. 